This is Insider Medicine in 60 from the UK. There may be a link between a high energy diet at the time of conception and the likelihood of giving birth to a son. Researchers investigating the diets of 740 first time mothers found that 56% of the women who had the highest energy intake had sons. Eating breakfast cereals and higher amounts of nutrients also seemed to increase the likelihood of having a male child. From Washington, according to a new report, breathing in even a small amount of ozone can lead to premature death in some people. Ozone, a powerful oxidizer, can damage human health by causing respiratory problems and worsening heart disease. The report recommends that health authorities keep ozone in mind when advising people to stay inside on days when pollution levels are high. And finally from Alberta, cancer survivors are more likely to be obese and less likely to exercise compared to the rest of the population, increasing their risk for relapse. In a study of over 114,000 adults, less than 22 percent of former cancer patients were physically active, compared to 25 percent of the general population. Many cancers have been linked to obesity and sedentary lifestyle, so the promotion of healthy eating and exercise may be especially important in cancer survivors. For Insider Medicine in 60, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.